Welcome back, I'm Danny the Dinosaur Drawer, and today we're going to draw the Jurassic World Boss T-Rex Omega-09 from Jurassic World the Game as a thank you to my 100th subscriber. So yeah, let's um, begin. I haven't uploaded a video in a while, so I apologize for that. I just had other things going on. But um, this is going to be a front angle of the Omega-09 T-Rex roaring for most of you. Because I know a lot of you requested this dinosaur, so I'm going to draw it. So, first I'm going to put in an outline, a box sort of for the head. So you just put like a, just copy what I draw. Just bit to get a shape of the head in right there. Because it's going to be facing toward us with the jaw open. Right about there. Just do this. Do it lightly. If you haven't watched the other videos, I explained um, you shouldn't press hard on your pencil when doing the outline. So this is the bottom jaw. This is a very very cool. T-Rex. It looks much cooler than the Indominus Rex. <laughs> Which is really cool, so. I'm going to put in the full spikes and everything. And I, it was, I found it really hard to um, find reference images for this. Like, still reference images of the Omega-09, so. This is the, the best one I could find. I might do another one in the future, because this one's probably not going to show its legs, which is unfortunate. Because, like, the feet are really cool, because, like, they, whenever they touch the ground, there's, like, electricity or something. Sparks from its feet. <laughs> if you get what I'm talking about. So there's, um, spikes go out the side. This is obviously not, like, a real real T-Rex, because I doubt they have all these spikes. It's got spikes almost everywhere. The eye will be right about there. I've got a cavity there, and then the nose. Then I'll put the teeth in a little bit later. So that's where what the head looks like. Now for the neck. The neck is more just a tube, basically. Or almost a just draw like a circle there for the neck. And the body is, would be another, it's almost like a snowman. <laughs> but very different. And his arms are very large as well. And his fingers are tucked in like that so you don't really see the claws that well. There's that arm. And there's one leg pointing straight at us. Again, this is, I always do the outlines very quickly. So if you get, if you have a lot of practice, you'll be able to do them quickly as well. And the tail just goes up like that. But you can't really see it because there's all these mega spikes and studs on its back. I don't want to make this look too sloppy, but <laughs> yeah, that's the outline. And now we can begin putting in more detail. So we'll start with the head. So you can really outline the shape of it. Just again it's got these armored studs that go up along the top ridge. And then the eye you can put like little scales in. Unfortunately, I don't think I'm going to pen in this drawing. I may do that later, but not definitely not in that this video. It will just take very long. <laughs> just you can put in the scales, just like I'm doing. Once you once you draw dinosaurs a lot, they become very easy. 
This has got a very big eye. So the eye just, um, yeah, I just do a, a, a half, a semicircle, I guess that's what you call it, and then just cut it in half, and that'll, that'll look pretty good. And then do a slit there for the center of the eye. And then you can give it a bit of shading on the outer edges. And then of course there's lots of wrinkles and stuff and lines around the eye. This is a very detailed dinosaur. <laughs> yeah, I think I'm just gonna leave it with pen pencil, I mean. So that looks good for now. I just want to set in some solid lines. I'm putting the spikes that are coming around the jaw. See, once you put an outline in, the, everything else becomes very easy. So his nose is quite small, actually. You don't feel doesn't. It's not really noticeable. And now for its teeth. The teeth are enormous. So teeth are pretty easy. They're just like drawing, almost like bananas, <laughs> on T Rexes. On the dinosaurs, it's more difficult, but T Rex teeth that are moderately easy to draw. So then, the, yeah, most all the teeth in this dinosaur are very big. And then the inside of the jaw, I'll just put a line in for that as well. Yeah, these teeth are really big. Um, might even make these two bigger. I don't want to disappoint anyone. <laughs> so yeah, and then this eye ridge gets even more complex <laughs> as you go higher. It's got spikes everywhere. And then it's got the other eye ridge. For the other eye. It goes over there, so. So I'm just going to detail in these studs. Just by putting lines across them like that. Mostly you'll learn by seeing what I'm doing, not by listening to what I'm doing listening to what I'm saying. <laughs> so now I'm just going to you can take an eraser. I don't have a fine one anymore. I, can't, I lost it, so hopefully I'll find it. Just take an eraser and make the teeth white because they're completely white in the picture I'm using. This T Rex must have a good dentist. <laughs> Let's put those. And like that. This tears looks quite fict fictitional. I don't know what you guys would say, but 
it's still really cool, so I decided to draw it. But it's definitely like a fake dinosaur, so. So it's got like these little, um, they almost like cuts that go up from its, between its teeth that are like shining red. Like if they're like electric or something like that. So you can shade in a bit around the eye. Like that. I know I'm taking a while, but this might be a several part video. So the bottom draw is not that hard. I won't even put this part in because the teeth are really big. Most of the bottom teeth are in the are in the front of the jaw, and they're very big. And they just disappear as they get near the back. But the ones in the very front are enormous. But this is a T Rex, so it's got the same like structure, the jaw and everything. It just had a bunch of stuff added to it. I really like these spikes on the side, though I must admit. <laughs> yeah, so they go out to the side and are a bit darker at the bottom. That's good for those spikes. Now I'm just gonna color in this, not color in, but like shade in with my pencil. And make this a darker shade. So you just shade in between the two teeth. And again, the teeth are completely white, so. You don't want to mess up there. So the jaw just ends right there. And you can just make these teeth look more realistic, the ones in the back, because they do have a bit of shading. Unlike the other ones, which are completely white. Then there's, this isn't T-Rex, has like these huge stretchy muscles. They look really weird, so I don't know how I'm going to draw them. <laughs> but there's, I'm just going to draw them how I regular, I draw regular dinosaurs. And also, there are, it's roaring, and there's these lines that are coming out from the dinosaur. So I will draw those as well. I don't know what you guys think of that. I think it's cool, but... So yeah, there's not that much scales on this. Just It's so shiny and stuff and elaborate that you don't really notice anything else. mostly just got lines so for this I'm just probably just gonna sh shade it a bit
Look at these cavities. It does have a lot of scales to go up on the top of the head. So you can put those in and then just add anything you want to give it more texture where you feel what you feel is right so probably not gonna make this the most detailed drawing ever though you guys will probably think it looked really detailed by the end so you can put scales along the rim of the mouth like so oh, let's make them very big as they get near the back I was smudging a bit but that's okay my goal right now is just to finish the head in time. At least get a basic outline for it. So we put in the tongue. And then again, it's quite dark back here. And now this may have seemed to take a while to get the head done, but I think it looks pretty awesome. So yeah, I think this video is coming to a close. Thank you so much, my 100 subscribers. Please check out part two, in which we will finish our amazing Omega 09 boss T-Rex from Jurassic World the game we'll probably just do the body and the legs and the arms and finish and probably refine the head a bit so yeah thanks for watching see you in the next video